My name is Millicent. I'm a biotechnologist working in the toxicology department. I have a B.Tech degree and I'm currently doing my M.Tech in biotechnology. Hi, my name is Tabiso and I am currently doing my M.Sc. in the toxicology department. I previously studied a B.Sc. honors degree in medical sciences. Hi, my name is Odwa and I'm a postgraduate student in the toxicology department. We are working on a project looking at toxicity of engineered gold nanoparticles made in South Africa. So before I answer that question, it's important for me to define what nanoparticles are. Nanoparticles are particles that have at least one external dimension that is less than 100 nanometers. Nanoparticle research is developing different nanoparticles to be used in biomedical, optical, and electronic fields. But before these technologies are used in products, we need to make sure that they are safe for both humans and the environment. This is where our work fits in. We are studying gold nanoparticles to see if they will cause any harm to humans. In our lab, we have cells that we bought from a company that come from different organs, and we use these for our experiments with the gold nanoparticles. I am working on bronchial cells to see what will happen if someone inhales the particles, and the liver cells too, because liver is responsible for detoxifying the body. I am using the skin cells to see what happens if someone gets the gold nanoparticles on their skin, and also using the colon cells to see what happens if the nanoparticles are swallowed. After the cells are treated with gold nanoparticles, we then conduct tests to see if the gold nanoparticles go into the cells or if they kill the cells. I'm also conducting tests to see if the gold nanoparticles cause any DNA damage which would then maybe mean that the particles could cause cancer. I am then also doing some gene expression work on RNA and protein to test for apoptosis or programmed cell death. My research is about the dissolution of nanomaterials in simulated biological and environmental fluids to try and predict what will happen to them in a real life situation. This work is very important because the gold nanoparticles may be used in products that will be sold to the public. So we need to make sure that these products are safe for, for human consumption before they can be put into the market. The NIOH focuses on occupational health. And so we also want to make sure that the people who are doing the research in the laboratories and those working in production plants are safe and are not going to get sick from the manufactured nanomaterials. Our work is part of a much bigger project with other universities. The final goal of the project is to come up with safety standards to